Hi internet, um, just a quickie. My uh, Regency Compact in Black has just arrived. Just finished cracking the box open. Um, I thought this would be a good first video for the new channel. And uh, honestly, I just can't wait to open it. First things first, I'm so happy it's in this. I love these boxes and I don't like it when I don't get them anymore. I didn't mind the um, the slide in slide out, but these are the best for storage and shipping if I sell them. <gasps> Look at this. Oh, I'm never selling you, baby. Oh. <laughs> okay, yeah. This is beautiful. This is worth every penny. Every penny. Um, the sale, I believe, is actually still on. So instead of paying $190 for the Regency Compact, I paid 114 US dollars. Um, so it's 40% off. It's, I think they still have some of the black in stock, like this one. It really is just... Oh my god, it's gorgeous. Even compared to my uh, Calypso, which you know I love. You can always tell the difference between the lower end and the higher end. And this is case in point, unfortunately. I mean, this is, I'm still, I still love the Calypso. Um, if nothing else, it got me hooked on the compact size. But it's my great summer binder. Unfortunately, summer has now left us. Um, I'm wearing socks and I was wearing a sweater earlier, so I need to start thinking winter and winter is going to be this baby if it's not year-round because It is just gorgeous um, <laughs> Yeah, you can It even smells nice. I Love these pockets. This was why I wanted the Regency um more than some of the other higher end binders because I have a thing for pockets and that's perfect because I use my compact now as my wallet um, and I think I actually did complain about my issues with the card holder so already here I win No problems with the rings. We have a winner. Oh, it really is as beautiful as you think. And what I love is it's so much softer than you think. Um, in the pictures, and even in the video, actually, compared to some of the people's videos, you can't tell just how squishy it is. Uh, it's, it's not stiff or hard in any way, shape or form. It is lovely and squishy. Look at that. Look at that! What? Beautiful. Okay, so let's do a quick, um, here. Personal Finsbury uh, to the Compact Regency. So you can see there's a significant difference to the side, as usual, as to be expected. Very little difference in the top. And of course, the width because of the small small rings which I have adapted to very well I have to say um, let's just take this out to save with the stuffing compared to my Calypso about the same in the width it's actually just a scooch higher and when I say a scooch I mean maybe what is that two or three millimeters, maybe half a centimeter. Literally, um, the Calypso grazes the stitching at the top here. So almost identical in size. Obviously not, <laughs> no, not when one of them's stuffed. I think this one actually has slightly bigger rings, but that's okay. Yeah, it's, it's um, beautiful. I can't think of the words to really sort of describe how much I'm in love with this. Wait. Oh, damn it. I thought I was okay because the uh, 
Rings were fine, but well, there's nothing in the box. I am missing my second half of 2013, which isn't the end of the world because if you've been paying any attention, you know I don't use them. I use my Chronodex system, which by the way, I've I've changed again and now added a calendar, but that's a whole big thing I'll get into in another video. Um, but I'm also missing the note paper. So no plane, no line, no to-dos. It's kind of sucky. I have the A to Z, which would be great if I used them. But yeah, no 2013, no note paper. That's a bit of a bummer. And again, I don't know if something's happened with Let's Canada or if I've just, you know, missed something. But this is the second uh, binder in a row that's come from Sweden. I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. I'm actually lucky I'm not getting dinged by customs in that case, really. But yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying um because I'm kind of dumbstruck. It's it's beautiful. It's the compact Regency in black and it is quite possibly my favorite thing on the planet right now and I haven't even moved into it. Um, 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 I love you. I'll do another video when I've um, had it for a few days. Also when I've heard from Filofax because I'm about to send them an email. If it was just the 2013 that was missing I probably wouldn't care. Um, but the notepaper's missing too. Okay, I got some loose threads. However, that could just be the machine thread left over. I'll have to have a tugsy and see what comes out. Because I really, really don't want to have to go through the rigmarole of exchanging or returning. I don't have that kind of patience. Oh, This is... I think it's going to be very hard for me to top this. As far as... Um, purchase satisfaction. I know everyone's kind of hooked on the Moldens at the moment, especially with the the Aqua finally being released in North America. Um, not my cup of tea. I've had the Molden. I do like the Molden. Um, I did actually see a compact zip Molden, which really piqued my interest, but not enough to really sort of make me pursue it. Um, and now I have this. I don't know. I don't know if I could ever top it because I'm really, I haven't even moved in and I'm really happy with it. It's going to take a lot to upset me or uh, turn my head. <laughs> We're going to have to come up with a name for you because you are totally my new boyfriend. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So if you're looking at the sale and that $114 price tag in the US, filofaxusa.com, just go for it. Honestly, you will not regret it. Um, the brown, I believe, is actually already sold out, but the black is still available. I prefer black, especially because it's my off-season binder. Um, yeah, absolutely, definitely worth the money. Bargain. Bargain! <laughs> Bye.